There's a couple ways you can go about emailing your document off. You could go ahead and copy the contents they're in and paste it into the body of the message of your email program. And assuming that you're using Outlook 2016 as your email program, that will help because that's what we're going to be using to send it off. You can open that up and also send it as an attachment, or you can use the Send to Mail Recipient feature. And to use that feature, you have to add that command to the Quick Access Toolbar. So to do that, let's right-click anywhere on it. So we can customize it. Click on that. Change it from Popular Commands to All Commands. And because it begins the command with the word Send, the letter S, let's click and drag and scroll down to the S's. And there we go, send a mail recipient. Double click on it to add it over to the right. Click OK. Adds it to the quick access toolbar. And you can see send a mail recipient. Click on it. Opens up the document and it gives you the option of who you want to email this to. Well, I'll email it to myself, specialk at videotrainingpro.com. Hit the tab key. And the subject, well, that's going to be the name of the document. You can go ahead and I'll delete that and say it's my special poem and then the introduction which is interesting because that's proprietary to this feature whatever you type in that box it's going to add it down below into the body of the message but separate that with the line underneath the introduction well I'll show you what I mean in just a minute so there we go there's totally no other way so when you're ready just go ahead and click on send a copy and away it goes and where does it go well click on start it goes to my Outlook 2016 program and it's in the out box here double click it's sitting in the out box until I hit send and receive but because I opened it up I can send it in just a minute but I wanted to show you what it looks like so the introduction is put right at the top of the message and it separates it with the line from the rest of the message down below or what used to be the document and when I'm ready go ahead and click send and it goes of course, it's going to come back to me in my inbox because, well, it's sent to me, so happy days. Double click. Oh, that's a nice poem. And of course, if you want to learn more about Outlook, it's more than just sending and receiving emails. You can also have pop up reminders for your tasks and assign tasks to others for your scheduled appointments, meetings, keep track of your contacts. Oh, it's a lot. Go ahead and watch my Outlook training videos. And then when we go back to our document, well, right back to where we were, you can keep that command up there until you want to do it again in another document or right-click on it to, of course, remove it. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel to get notified of the latest videos. And for great specials on my products, please see the description below this video.